Hey guys, so today I'm going to do kind of a just beauty shopping haul of everything that I've bought in the last month. I uh, did a lot of kind of, you know, makeup and skincare shopping this last month, so uh, I really wanted to share that all with you, so let's get started. I'm going to start with Tarte Cosmetics, and the first thing I got was the Tarte Amazonian Clay Foundation. I have seen really good reviews on this, and I have, I actually follow them on Snapchat, Tarte Cosmetics, and uh, whenever they use, or whenever, you know, somebody uses this on their Snapchat, it just looks so natural and beautiful. Um, and I figured I should give it a try. And there will be a first impression and review coming on this. I know it's not new, but it's new for me and I've never used it. And the next thing I got from Tarte Cosmetics was the Nicole Concilio brush set and they are beautiful. I love the gold and they're so soft. I think they were just going to look amazing with my whole beauty setup and all my other brushes, so I had to get them. And I needed some of the brushes anyways. Now on to ColourPop. So I actually have already done a lip swatch video of all the lipstick colors that I got from ColourPop. So I will link that down below. I don't want to go on forever in this video. I also got three of the lippy pencils and I got them in the colors. I heart this Contempo LBB. Now as far as the eyeshadow colors go. I got the color Porter. I also got the color Coconut. And I got the color Shameless Lace. Cricket. And then I got the color So Quiche. Now from Reversel, I got the Papaya Cleanser, and I love this face wash. It smells so great, and it really just makes my face feel so smooth and clean. And then I got the Clarifying Toner, and um, I really like this toner. I just feel like I go through it really fast. And then the next two items I got from Reversel were two moisturizers, and I haven't tried either of them before, and so I can't really give a review or say anything, uh, say too much about them. So the first one I got was the PM Anti-Aging Moisturizer, and this one's supposed to be really good at kind of preventing wrinkles, and I feel like that's just kind of something important. And then the other moisturizer I got was the Sensitive Skin Moisturizer, and I don't really have sensitive skin, but it says it's a really soothing hydrator. I feel like that's important going into fall and winter to, you know, have a moisturizer that's really hydrating for your face and it also says it's really lightweight which to me is pretty important because I hate just like when I put on a moisturizer and it makes my face feel so like heavy or it feels heavy on my face and it just makes my face feel like greasy I just I hate that feeling and now on to everything that I bought from Sephora one of the things I got was this uh, makeup forever eyeshadow palette and it is the palette 9 and it comes in all these really pretty colors so I just had to get it. And then the thing that I'm probably most excited about uh, from getting from Sephora was the Urban Decay Moon Dust palette. I'm sure you've already seen it but it comes in all these really pretty colors and they're sparkly and glittery and that's perfect. For me because I love anything that's sparkly and glittery. I also got the Glam Glow Super Mud Clearing Treatment uh, face mask and I love this face mask. I use it all the time. I just ran out and I had to get a new one. I also got the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. I had seen a lot of other people using it and I figured I'd give it a try and I really like it so far. I got the Clinique Pore Refining Solutions. It's a charcoal mask and uh, I haven't used it yet, but I'm really excited to see how it works. I also got the Fresh Rose Face Mask. Um, you can't really see that, but it is a hydrating face mask, and I have used it, and I was really surprised because it was... Uh, it didn't really dry on your face. It kind of just stays like a gel on your face, which was weird. Um, but I like it. Next I got a bunch of lipsticks. So I had initially bought um, this Bite Beauty lipstick in the color Thistle and I really liked it. And then when I was shopping online on Sephora the other day I saw that they had this little kit which was the price of one lipstick and there are four sample sizes in Fig, Pepper, Honeycomb, and Nori. And 
I mean, how could you say no to that? And then as I was looking at the rest of the lipstick shades, I saw some other beautiful colors. So I'm just going to do a lipstick swatch video on these, like a separate video. So I'm just going to tell you the colors. And I got them in the color Jam, Beetroot, and Radish. So I got these Sephora brand eyeliners in the colors Purple Stiletto, Romantic Comedy, Good Mood. I also got this Benefit, um, what is it, Soft and Natural Brow Kit. So it comes with the... Uh, goof proof pencil the highbrow pencil and the ready set brow there is actually nothing in there because they're all in my beauty drawer these are them they're pretty cool looking I also ended up picking up the benefit brow zings which is powder and a gel and also when I was in there in Sephora the other day I picked up the Too Faced Born This Way foundation I have seen so many other people say such great things about this so I really wanted to try it for myself so there will also be a first impression video coming on this because um, again it's not new but it's new to me the last thing that I got from Sephora was the Jaclyn Hill Champagne Pop I didn't have a highlighter and everybody talks about this one and it's actually been in my shopping cart uh, for a long time but I've just kind of taken it out to put other things in there. I also just got a few samples in my online orders. Um, I got the Urban Decay All Nighter Foundation and the Makeup Forever Ultra HD uh, foundation and so I'll try those. I think that's everything. I don't think I forgot anything. I hope I didn't at least but it's possible. Um, but yeah so let me know if you liked this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Let me know if there's anything uh, if you've tried any of these and if you like any of them or any other products that I need to try. Um, yeah thank you uh, for watching and I'll see you in a future video. Bye guys!